Okay, what's going on everybody? Welcome to the next Freaktography Urban Exploration Abandoned Extravaganza. Today, I'm going to explore a big abandoned house. Yesterday, I posted this house on Facebook and I thought, this house is no big deal. I'll just throw it up, whatever. Well, you guys seem to really like it. So I thought I'd come back today, do a video and show you the inside of it. So here you can have a look. There's your outside of the house. Can you see it? It's a bit bright, so the sky's bright making the house in some shadow. But there's your house, four car garage. Really nice windows up front. So let's just get right to it while I'm walking in, heading up the stairs. Let's cue the music. Let's cue the intro. Let's check this place out. Here we go guys, working our way in the front door, hopefully nobody's home, was in yesterday, hello, is anybody here, anybody here, first thing you do kids, if you're an explorer, you're exploring an abandoned house, you always want to call out, see if there's anybody here, is anybody here, sounds like nobody's here, nobody's home, nobody's squatting, nobody's up to no good, so it's just you and me, guys, inside this abandoned house. So like I said, four-car garage, pretty big house. There's me right there. Have a look. This is what I look like, guys. Take my hat off. My hair's getting long. I definitely need a haircut. Got to shave my head soon, but uh, not today. I'm busy right now. So here we go. We're going to turn the camera around. We're going to take a look. We're going to pan down. Nice staircase as soon as you walk in. All right. So we're going to go to the left, and we're going to check out this bedroom over here. You got a bathroom right here, all right. Take a look, standard bathroom. Heading on through, this is a, I'm guessing this is the bedroom. Super nice windows, nice view of across the street. I think this would be a bedroom. I don't know what else it would be. But uh, yeah, here you go. Let's take a look around. From the corner here. So yeah, I thought you guys would like a video tour of this house since the people on Facebook yesterday really uh, seemed to like this house. When I posted pictures of it, got a lot of response, lots of comments. So here I am, guys. I came back and I'll give you guys a personal tour via video on the Freetography YouTube page. Since you're here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I always appreciate people who subscribe to my YouTube page, follow along with my adventures. Okay guys, so here we got some kids toys here. I'm gonna pan down. We got a easy bake oven, little girl's easy bake oven right there, okay. There you got some kind of a little dollhouse. You got a single roller blade, and then whatever the heck this thing is right here. Moving along. We've got a radio here, some cards, some Pokemon cards. There you go. Some little mirrors that go on the wall and a lone flip-flop. Okay, moving along. Let's put this up. As you guys have noticed, I'm filming with my fancy new gimbal today that keeps my filming very fluid and not skippy and not jumpy. So watch this, with my new gimbal, I can pan the video up, I can pan the video down, okay, I can pan left to the right if I want, here I'll show you this right here, there's going to the left, I mean to the right, there's going to the left, nice and smooth guys, nice and smooth, alright, so moving along, we will go back here to the kitchen and the dining room area, here's your uh, your living room area, I'm guessing, living room or dining room. Here you've got some shattered glass. So my guess here is this was maybe where, maybe it was the TV, maybe it was a table with a glass countertop. I don't know. Either way, the house is pretty empty and there's broken glass everywhere. 
So we have to be careful. Moving into the kitchen, got a pretty nice big kitchen here. Take a pan around. Oh, I'm gonna pan the wrong way. There you go, up you go. So you come on into the kitchen. Again, super nice windows. Nice view of the backyard, which doesn't look very nice today, but I'm guessing, you know, you got a cornfield over here to the left. That's pretty nice, nice country living. And then here is where you'd have, well, there would have been a stove right here and your dishwasher right there. Oh, we got a sympathy card here. That's nice, let's see what we got here. It's very sad. What's this say? With sympathy, may precious memories help you through this difficult time. That is sad, I'm not gonna read the name, but it's a shame, it does seem that there was a death in the family, so that's too bad. What's happening here? Let's put this back up. Okay, and as is to be expected in an abandoned house, you had some stupid kids come in and they found some, some stuff and they, they whacked holes in the wall. There you go. Stupid kids whacking holes in the wall. As to be expected when you're exploring an abandoned house. Okay, one last look at the kitchen. There it is. Okay. We'll go downstairs now. What do you think of that? Head down. Stairs are very nice. Nice wooden stairs. All right. Pan up. Unfinished basement, guys. Got some water damage there on the floor. Some leaky windows, possibly. Here you've got just a bunch of stuff that looks like somebody was going to store or maybe collect and put away or this is just stuff that they decided that they didn't want. So that's too bad. You've got some kids toys and you've got some other stuff. And you got a little, little boys truck here that you can go for a ride on. Looks like they used to have a fireplace down here. Right here, let me just pan back up again. There you go. For a old fireplace. Panning around, there's not much more to see. Here's your staircase from the basement. Maybe this was finished at one point and they uh, took everything out. I don't know. Move along. So that's likely your, your water system. Yeah, there's a well there. A very disgusting looking washer and dryer here. And then here's your furnace and your water heater. Okay. So that's it. Basement sucks. Now let's head back up and we'll go all the way upstairs. See what's going on up there. I do want to remind you guys while we're walking up the stairs here, I have signed up myself for a Patreon account and Patreon is where subscribers can help support my page through small monetary monthly donations. So right now I'm gonna put a link in the video where you can click to go to my Patreon page, select what uh, level of support you wanna give. It goes from $1 a month, $5 a month, $10 a month, $20 a month, or as much as 100 if you want. And every level, of support gets free perks, all right? There's the link, I appreciate that. Okay, take a deep breath here. <sighs> all right, some more holes in the wall. Thanks to stupid kids, this would be your master bedroom, quite clearly. Come on over here. We got some books on the floor here. Nancy Drew books, Disney story books. Then we got some brassieres on the floor. It's a weird thing to leave behind. Here we got a book about the Titanic. That's an interesting read, I'm sure. All right. Let's put this back up. 
Here we are again. There's me. Shattered. Shattered reflections. Still need a haircut. Bathroom. That's about it. Bathtub. Sink. Toilet. Let's move on. Back up to there. Moving around here. Got some stuff on the floor here. There's another reflection of me. What's up, guys? And let's see here. Hold on a second. Why isn't this working? Oh, I know why. I'm doing it all wrong. There we go. So we got some shoes and some books here. Just some random stuff. Move into this bedroom here. And it's quite possible that someone was squatting in this room for a while. It looks like it. You've got a mattress up against the wall. You've got a number of blankets and pillows inside here. Quite possible that somebody decided to come in here and live in this place for a while. Thank God they're not home now. Here's a picture of uh, maybe one of the girls who lived here. One of her friends. Photo booth from Urban Outfitters. There you go. Fab U Plus magazine. All bodies are beach bodies. Confidence is sexy when worn right. When life throws you curves, embrace them. She looks very happy. Stuffed animals. What do we got here? This looks interesting. What does this say? Let's see here. I like this right here. My feelings right now. Sad, mad, depressed, hurt, heartbroken, fed up. Thanks for making me feel this way. Sad face. Wow. All right. That's enough of that. Okay, anyways, big window. Stuff on the floor. Let's go to the next rooms here. This way, here's a, here's a bathroom. A little bit of graffiti. We got a heart on the wall there. Some broken glass. Here's me again. Can you get to me? Where am I? There I am. What's up guys? This is my fancy new gimbal. See here? Here's how it works. To the left, I mean to the right. To the left, nice and smooth. Up and down. See that? I really like this thing. Keeps my videos nice and smooth. A lot of people used to complain that my videos were too jumpy. Well, now they won't complain anymore. Okay, here we go. Let's go in here. We got some graffiti in this room. What the hell's this say? Dabs. I don't know who the dabs are, but they were here. Here's somebody's attempt at some very artsy graffiti with a very creepy looking feature coming from the floor, as you can see here. And he works his way up and then he's spitting things from his head that are traveling all over the wall. So that's somebody's attempt at art. Not a very good job. Here's another one here. Sword through the rose. I don't know what that's supposed to symbolize but it's a sword through the rose. And then here, take a look at this door. It says, come in. And we're coming in, come inside the room, and you got this right here. So my guess is I'm supposed to stand there, and it looks like I'm an angel with wings and with a halo. Unfortunately, guys, I'm here all alone, and I got nothing to put my gimbal on, or I don't have anybody to hold my camera for me so I can stand there and be the angel. So I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I cannot do the angel thing today. Oh, what we got here? Seven minutes in hell. Oh, wonder what happened in there. So I'm not going to go out and show you the backyard because it's just a dump. There's a big empty barn down there. There's nothing in it. I was in there yesterday. It's totally empty. There's a bunch of tires back there. Just some stuff. Looks like they had a, some animals or something. But that's really it. 
So let's take a walk back downstairs. It's cold today, guys. I'm getting my exploring in today because this weekend is supposed to be really cold, bad snowstorms, and I'm not going to want to go exploring. So I'm getting it done today, guys. Okay, everybody, so that does it. This has been the abandoned house for Car Garage. Very nice house. My guess is it's going to be torn down for development. The whole neighborhood, the whole area here has been sold to developers. And if you look outside, look across the street, they are building a new subdivision right across the street. And my guess is that it will only be a matter of time before they start uh, working on this side. So this house here, probably going to be demolished, torn down. They're going to get rid of the corn crops and probably put up a new house. So, so this has been it. I hope you guys have liked this one. Real quick and dirty explore. I'm going to move on to some other things. So, one, like my video. Make me a comment down below. Tell me what you guys have thought of this video. If you have some place you can share this video, share it. These things tell YouTube that you're interested in my content. These things tell YouTube that my stuff is interesting, which YouTube then shows it to more people, which is how you can support my page. Also, down below, Patreon, link to the Patreon page. If you can support me, on Patreon. I greatly appreciate it. If not, that's okay. Patreon has exclusive content that I will only share to Patreon people or YouTube content that I will share early to get you early access. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Thanks for this tour. Thanks for sticking around. Thanks for following me. See you guys in the next adventure. Peace.